What can I do for you, Mrs. Fitzgerald? The legal age for emancipation of a minor is 14 in the state of California. It's the law. You might want to check it out. Anna's 11. You're three years too early. I'm aware of the law. She's challenging. She can't. She's too young to stand for herself. I'm filing for her as guardian ad litem. As what? A family independence agency? I have 15 years as a volunteer member of the ACLU, in addition to which I have this power of attorney. Signed by your daughter. This will never hold up. It's not even legal. Anna doesn't want to do it anymore. And 11 years old or not, she has rights. And so long as she wants to move forward, I am going to help her. Why? What's your interest? This isn't a case for you. What There's is no my money interest? in it. Eight hospitalizations in 11 years, six catheterizations, two bone marrow aspirations, two stem cell purges. She was helping her sister. Not to mention the side effects, including bleeding, infections, bruising. Filgrastum shots, those are growth hormones, am I correct? Something like that. Drugs for nausea, opiates for pain, Ambien for sleep, not exactly the proper medication for preteen. Every procedure had its risks and complications. Anna understood that. She was okay with it. Really? Yeah. At five years old. Could you? <laughs> Bob, you're good. You're really good. You know, I've seen your commercials, right? I mean, who hasn't? And I always thought that you were some sort of headline-seeking hack, but you have real talent. You almost had me believing that you cared about Anna. Honey, I was about to say the same thing to you. Mrs. Fitzgerald, did you ever say to yourself, maybe I'm wrong, maybe I took it a little too far? I'll see you in court. <laughs>